Make sure his, his, his stuff is wrong. There ain't no plugging. Talk. That's a good point in some way. Talk. Talk. You, you. Yeah. Fuego, fuego. Fuego in the building. What up, what up, what up, my man? So there's a lot of things going on in Jersey tomorrow. Um, one of the things that uh, that's going on is um, so basically tomorrow, no saying we got a um a artist and music drive going on and a registered voter event and um in North New Jersey, you know, saying that between the borderline and Bloomfield, basically Bloomfield at five uh fifty four Bloomfield Avenue in New Jersey. Um, so you know, right now what we're doing tomorrow, we're gonna be doing a special event. For like the artists in the music industry, no, what time is that? like that, um, we're gonna be doing from nine o'clock to one. And that's in the so, museum. All right, I and think this one, this one is gonna be at the Afro Brazilian Culture Center of New Jersey. Where's that at? Five fifty four Bloomfield. Yeah, Torch. In Bloomfield. I've, I've been seeing some of the shit that you be, some of the shit that you be doing. Like um, that bitch that was holding. I mean, I'm sorry, I don't want to call her the female. Bitch, the female. The female that was holding three plates on a little, like a little stroll. Right. It was just twirling and twirling and twirling. I, I was like, I like that. Um, I think some paintings that you guys were doing, right. showing kids how to do stuff. Right. So give give uh, my audience, our, our audience, um, a little background on even the uh, the mural that you painted uh, here. Actually, I really like those plates you recently did that you've been posting. Right. Those are really nice. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna I was gonna ask you to make me a too sunny one, but I didn't want to get you out your comfort uh, zone. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm gonna make one for you. Yeah, e e email me when you do some crazy like event like that because I, I do like those things. Right. And so it's always a So to get into the event, like more like mm -hmm. so like what what exactly is everything? Let's break it down to everybody. All right. So basically, you no know, saying what's going on for tomorrow is the um I say everybody can come through. You no know, saying ten dollars at the door. New Jersey Drive and the Artist Music Coat and Blankets, you know what I'm saying, event um, at the Afro Brazilian Culture Center of New Jersey uh, at 554 Blue Flag in New Jersey by Adam Cruz, you know what I'm saying, so big up to them, you know what I'm saying, for having me a part two of, uh, you know what I'm saying, this major event, you know what I'm saying, that's about to go down, so pretty excited for that. And, uh, you know, uh, back to the plates, you know what I'm saying, I appreciate that because, uh, you know, uh, shout out to New Museum too. Also, yeah, man. Shout out to New Museum. Because uh, they actually, this is the second time that they, uh, you ready, um, yeah, it's um, teaching. It's, it's not inviting me, but they're saying they hired me. They're saying to teaching know, the kids. Teach, teach, you know what I'm saying? And the and community. Community. That's a big yeah, move. Yeah, that is yeah, definitely, yeah, definitely. When you get into the North Museum, bro, or NJ Pack or shit like that, like, that's you're doing something great. Yeah. Have you yeah. seen the, like, his murals? Like, that's the thing that, like, they, 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 they're, they're just. They're a story of themselves. You, you know, know what's the crazy part? I mean, I've seen I people up, sit here and take pictures and just. For the public, man. Just, so, wow. You right. Know, yes. And the crazy part is, I knew Torch since I was like eight. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, was since you was like and younger. Yeah, <laughs> no, but like I, I like we used to have the studio in the basement. Shout out Unique Entertainment. You feel me? Well, and he, you know, I'm sorry, yeah, like, and he he did a nice ass mural in the basement of the nigga that that was his entertainment thing, and it came out nice. You get what I'm saying? Ever since then, but back then, Rockstar Entertainment. You get what I'm saying? Rockstar Entertainment. Shout out Les. Shout out all of them. Shout out on Shane. You get me? Like, like. Yo, I, so, so after, if you guys go to that event, it's gonna be an amazing event to do. Um, also, uh, my partners at CKO uh, and Bloomingdale um, are gonna do an event tomorrow. And it's gonna be called a CKO boot camp. It's a CKO camp, and it's gonna be like in a boot camp situation. So it will be. So they're gonna be running drills, telling running you drills. Stuff I like always it. tell people what to do, bro. That's why I was always born oh, to so do. You're the boss. That's why I was born uh, to do. Right. I tell people what so, to do. I never I take orders. Dig it. I can dig it. Yeah. Right, so definitely, you know what I'm saying? So shout out to New Museum for that, you know what I'm saying? That was yeah. definitely a, a, a big inspiration, you know what I'm saying, to me also, you know what I'm saying? And especially a, a big movement. And it actually, you know what I'm saying, made history because I'm like one of the, you know what I'm saying, I don't know if any graffiti artists, you know what I'm saying, ever done that, you know what I'm saying? Right, 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 right. You know so, uh, Newark or anywhere else, who, you know what I'm saying? You, you, got, you, you got to be at least top 100, top 50, top, you know, I'm talking about nationwide. Right. You got to be up there with that because it's... But you know what the other thing is? There's a lot of graffiti artists that don't participate in things like that. They don't want to teach. But you, did, you also did the. You know what I'm saying? You also did the breast cancer awareness in uh, down neck um, in New Jersey. Yeah, shout out, um, shout out Bam. Brody's in the building. What's going on, Bam? 
What's going on, baby? Like, you, do a lot of, you, do, you do a lot of things, and I and, and I and I and I follow your Instagram, and I this, and, I, and I see all the stuff that you do, <coughs> which is off the street. You know, that's what I like. We could be hood. We are all like I'm hood. So you know, I've been a for a long time. I've been in the street for that's why I started. You know what I'm saying that's that's where the essence comes from. I'm about I, 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 I think that we can also, there's a lot of CKOs that like to do all the graffitis and stuff like that. And we're known for like the different sayings on the walls. So maybe we can somehow or another get a collaboration. We're, 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 we're opening up everywhere. Collaboration. We're opening up everywhere. Right now, when I when I became owner, there was like 80 something. I think right now there's 100. Um, CKOs and we got Miami, Orlando, Boston. We got uh, but they're all Texas. the same owner, but you guys sold that franchise. We're, 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 it goes by the same we're, corporate. We're, 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 we're all franchise owners, like me, my partners, and everybody who owns our. But you guys locations. are the original founders. I no, mean. um, there's a, the original founder is Joe Aguila. Um, I say his name wrong all the time. But I say. But Joe, Joe, Joe uh, from Hoboken, um, and his brother. They, they formed this and they did a great job and they gave us a platform. I take mine to a different level. I see different CKOs take this to a different level. But um, at the end of the day, we're good. We do what, what you do. You, you, we network, we go out, we, we enjoy what we do. And it's an art. You know, when, when I perform, because I, I call it a performance, every single day I have to do two performances, an hour long. I have to teach you how to kick the bag. I have to teach you how to hit. I got to teach you how to you know, feel the what I'm feeling, you know, like, and well, you want to express your feelings, this, you know, like, everything that you do. That's well, anything you do and have to show an individual is called the performance, because you got to show them, you know what I'm saying? So it's good to show people at the end of the day, because sometimes they might do this instead of doing that, when this might be bad and that might be you know, good. But it's, it's a little bit of difference, you know, say, too, because, you know, say, once it comes to talent, you know, right. say, <laughs> and knowing them, Knowing something, you know, saying, or something that comes natural to you, you know, saying. So it was funny. It was speaking of that, of that certain, it was funny. Like yesterday, like a whole different group of people came into my to my class. Um, they were like, "Oh, ooh, see me do my move, you know, some of the stuff, you know." And I'm like, "It's nothing. This is, this is what I do." You know? It's nothing serious. And, and, and my regular members do this every single day. I make them do it every day, you know. So. It's like you, you, you get some of the things that I wonder about how you do your shit. Is, yeah, yeah, yeah. It starts off with a line right here, and then you put a spray over there and a curve here, and then you curve do there. Yeah, here, yeah, 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 yeah. And then you go back. It's, 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 it all starts you know, saying, with a thought. You know, you know what I'm saying it comes with that vision. See what you're doing. It's, 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 it's come with that thought. You know what I'm saying first. You know what I'm saying coming out with the vision. You know what because that's the difference too. You know what I'm saying between the artists too. You know what I'm saying because I'm more of a freestyle. You know what I'm saying visionary artist, you know what I'm saying? That I could vision something, you know what I'm saying? Straight up from the back, you know what I'm saying? Just try to bust it out. You know what I'm saying? Without using any stencils, rulers, you know what I'm saying? Things like that. It's like a blueprint. See, I say I see what you're doing and what what you're doing is becoming more inspirational for others. You know what I'm saying? Because you you're not only taking your art and putting it in the hood, you're taking your art and you putting it into a art museum, right. into North Museum, and now you're teaching kids and you're getting paid for it, which is, I mean, on top of teaching kids art, something that you love to do, something that, that I mean, you taught yourself how to do, now, now you have that opportunity to put everything that you have together, all your right, knowledge, right, and right, pass right. it on to the younger generation. So they it could inspire them and be like, yo, when I grow up, I want to be an artist. Right. And they go home, and mom, I want some coloring pencils. And, yep. and they go home and start and some drawing and shit. So, so, and that's how it starts, you know what I'm saying? So, so, that's so, what it's all about, planting well, the seed. You know, well, so basically, the, so the museum say, gave you an uh, art class. So, so, that's so, what it is, right? I want to know the next so, art so, class. So, I want to so, take my so, daughter. It's yeah, Sundays, I'll, right? No, I want to go. I'm going to see you next time, no saying which they're going to hire me. I want to take my daughter. Yeah, this is my second time that they hired me for uh, for an event, you know what I'm saying? And That's amazing. I've last time, I'm saying, I try to take my son's last time. They inspired me to have my own workshop, so they actually yeah. gave me my own workshop. Oh, last week. Your last workshop was hey, last week, right? Or the week before? Yeah, it was yeah. last week, right? Yeah, week. yeah see, I, I was trying to take my son, like, you want to take his daughters? But my baby mom's been tripping. Right. I, it's hard to get a hold of that. So let's, right let's dissect a little into the brain of Torch, right? Let's figure out. You should let them know that you start doing painting you know, stuff get too as well. Oh, yeah. You talk about the beats. Yeah, 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 the beats is like 100 beats. But, you 
artists. Cool. Like, yeah. Yeah. Artists yeah. Yeah. I heard some beats that yeah. I've, I've seen. Seen. I've seen you. I've seen you always working. You know, yeah. so I don't know all your personal life or whatever. Yeah. What is your personal life? What do you? What takes your time? What you know? What's your? Well, you know, um, I am a father. You know, what I'm saying first time. You know, what I'm saying uh, shout out to my baby boy Skyler. You know, shout out Skyler, little torch, baby Fuego, Tony Rican. You know, what I'm saying Tony Rican. Tony Rican. Blonde hair, blue eyed baby. I'm telling you, man. God bless. Yeah, shout out to Sicilia. Shout out to Italy. Shout out to Italy. So you know my personal life between the you know, same my art life. You know I've been trying to you know being an artist. You know it takes a long time to draw. You know, saying to get an idea. You, know, you make this shit for Bro, you did this shit for the yeah, freaking parade, like in freaking like half an hour. But you right, right. you a whole right. iPhone it's on the back with like, nope. But you know what it is. Crazy. He has you know, strategies already. He goes yeah, exactly. You got your strategizers already set, and like he got his priorities straight with his. His wow. strategies, wow. so he knows like like rejects. You see how he did the rejects? I'm more on this. This is freestyle. This is what I look at detail, like all of this stuff. Right. You see this, and to bring that blue out, that yellow, right? This black, like like, a different like how do you, mic. like did you do this with like some type of line or something? Like or that was just like straight like. Um, it's all spray paint. I'm you know, saying shout out to my antenna too. You know, that's you know, it crazy. Like companies, you know, saying that's really huge. You know, I don't, don't want to change. You know, saying yeah, that been coming up with this. You know what I'm thinking about? Actually, you know, the saying, that allows you, you know, saying to get more into detail. Right, you know, right, right. right. So basically, it's just all tones, you know what I'm saying, and, and depending on your strategy, you know what I'm saying, or your precise, you gotta be real precise, and depending on how, how, how hard you press the cap, you know what I'm saying, how lightly, you know what I'm saying, you get the facts, then, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, so, the it's, it's all depending you know, on, your, on your pressure. So have you ever thought about, like, making your own spray paint? That'd be dope, saying, like, you can make your own spray paint, because you've been doing this for years, mm -hmm. since I met you. You've been doing this shit for years. You get what I'm saying? And if you come out with a spray paint, I believe exactly. Yeah, I believe niggas would buy it because you know there's a whole bunch of different things in spray paint. You get what I'm saying? Or like those, I don't know what they called, but you know those shit that drip, that look like a fucking pen, but it's not a pen or a marker that you squeeze it. Yeah, that you squeeze in the shit leaks. That. I believe you can make one of those too. Listen, when you decide to sell. I'm going to you for some prizes too. Like you know, Christmas, Go. Christmas is right this month. And so, you know what it is like too. Like the Lotto's right there. My mom would love like that. My father would love that. My in laws that would love fine China. Like that. that fine like China. That, that's, it, that's a perfect gift to give to, right. especially an older Boricua. When you give them the scenery of Puerto Rico yeah, on the play with their name, and right, that's right, just right. like a good present for. Uh, this no, is an older so, 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 so Torch, I haven't raffled off the gloves. They, 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 people have been paying like that, putting a dollar here, dollar there, whatever. Mm -hmm. Uh, I've been collecting the money. Why don't you come to the gym one day and actually pick the winners of the of the rounds? Oh, that'd be yeah, nice. I'll go with you for that. that Bring the gloves and do a little graffiti, graffiti on them. Yeah, and, and then you know, like whatever, you know, right. I'll give you a class. Right, that's He's like, I'll give you a yeah, class. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just to let y'all know, update four fifteen, four seventeen, Halsey Street tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Open mic, open mics, open mics. So open mics yeah. You're gonna have good God in the building. Yeah, a lot of dope artists is going to be on Definitely, tonight, definitely. Right? Shout out to my boy BZ too, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, shout BZ out to going to be out there tonight. Oh, I was just about to give BZ a shout out as BZ well. BZ coming on night? Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. BZ, he's a featured artist, actually. Oh, that's what's up. Oh, yeah, he is the featured artist yeah. for today, man. I'm yeah. glad you're looking at the show. Shout out Remy Boys. You, you know shit is real. You know shit is real when Bam is, um... In the peak coat. He got the peak coat on. Yo, why y'all niggas jealous? Yo, don't give me a snack on the stage. He's like, I'm not going to be standing on the Nigga, we got reject shoes. Let's talk about these shoes. Good God. Reject shoes. Let's talk about these shoes. We got hazy kids. You already know it's hazy kids. This shit's real. Ah, niggas doing it. Niggas doing it, bro. Don't even fuck with it. Don't be crazy. Be fire. And after that, make sure y'all tune into the bars of the bullshit. Hey, yo, Jay, you know what I'm saying? Good God! He got the handy. Anything's possible. Anything is possible when you fucking with rejects. Alright, so so one thing the science want to bring up. So I'm gonna be having a talk. Yeah, yeah. The M and I view program of the city. So shout out to them too also. Shout out to the hey, 
Let's say we're not in the class. I drink nothing but heavy. I don't disrespect. I drink nothing but heavy. Me neither. Who is one person that fucked up today? No, he worked with or had blood. That's what I buy. Listen, I'm not doing it. Like Newark Museum. It doesn't have to be a person. That could be a situation. Who is one person that feels so excited that you had hard work with? Oh, man. He told me that I had a pain on me tomorrow. North International Airport. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Tell us about this. Tell us about that, yo. That's so, crazy. Uh, you know, because I'm also an airbrush artist. So I right, right, right. Airbrush. So, um, you know, being a part of Rockstar Entertainment. Um, shout out Rockstar Entertainment. Shout out Rockstar You know what I'm saying? In the um, Jamaican world, you know what I'm saying? Side with the whole dance hall scene. So, you know, I was, I was doing a lot of artwork in the youth. studios. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, um, I, I did all the artwork in their studio. Yeah. 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 Which I was a part of doing a lot of promotion. Yeah. 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 He even did the, um, remember Shoe so, Fly? The shoe fly he did the, the oh, graphics for Shoe Fly as well. Oh, nice. Yeah. We come out of Lewis, but I got to say, for putting over there, we ended up getting locked, locked up. For my Spray, paint Spray paint all over the New York, New Jersey. Downtown, high yeah. 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 Yo, remember Shoe Fly, though? Exactly. Shoe Fly with it. But, you know, ain't no shoe fly. Yeah. 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 You know what's crazy? You know, I still have five places that have Shoe Fly. Right. I'm you from know Jersey, Jersey Lanes in Linden. Savage? Um, Jersey Lanes is a bowling alley in Linden. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They have a wall in the back that they let uh -huh. people tag up. Yeah, yeah, that's and then they, my people's out there. And then they um, paint should, over yeah. it. You don't got a whatever. mural there yet? Right. No, I'm not you out there. You should go to I did no sense to get a lot of work for the past. Right, right, right. Yeah, but with the North International part, like the airport part, like what exactly is all about? Alright, so basically, they hired us to do the entertainment. Always talking about the airbrush. So basically, I was doing the airbrushing that they hired me to do for the second year since they hired us for the entertainment. Yeah, I think so. So my people was doing the DJs. I'm saying, um, what about PR friend? Yeah. Hey, yo, he didn't pick up. But listen, I'm about to get a hold of bro. This is a lot of work now, man. Yo, just take him that you did the breast cancer for. I swear to God, I was crazy at the club. I don't know what it is now. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, so it was the Sharp James, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and mommy talked about how it goes. Yeah, exactly. I don't know what happened with the situation, but all I know, the stadium, to the bandits, to the girl. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, and, and, you know, because the show has been contaminated. I called him, and, uh, but he didn't you know, since we just started a boxing program, like, you know, Iron Bounds. I didn't call you back because this is what I'm doing. Look. Look. I'm saying shout out to Gary. I'm saying shout out to my team. Also, that's what I just left the arms and the microphone to talk to you. Also, that's out there teaching the community. Nah, I'm good right now. So, you know, we got to pay for paint that we started over here for breast cancer awareness. Yes, I would. The first of the work. Iron Bound USA. Um, that his wife just got diagnosed. Nine o'clock, dog. Is um, you know, serious? With breast cancer. Yeah. And she ended up, you know, passing away. You know, saying all the PD stuff. Wow. So, you know, saying it's it's crazy. That's easy. So it's we started. We started the movement. You know, saying over here, one of our factories that we got permission to do. You know, wild, but hey, Muhammad, let my let my buzzer go, man. Before I had the Molly walk through us. Same for our loved ones that passed away. Hey, yo, I'm about to call cousin right now. So, you know, last year, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to call you right back in two seconds. Walls, because we got a whole yeah, yeah. two factories, you know what I'm saying? Out there, too, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to the next year. Four next hours, next hours. year, I'm going to take you guys to um, um, Cedar Grove Apartments. We do a, I, I do a, an event every single year for the breast cancer. And um, it's, it's. See, that's me to link up with CK Advisor. You know, I did no, that. No, 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 no. I, I, I got to participate with events with him. Like, you know, the Giant Stadium thing, that was number one. That I was still the bad We did Giant Stadium, and that shit was ill. Like, I, I mean, I was on I was on the 50 yard line at Giant Stadium. You know what I'm saying? I had somebody, I had somebody throw me a football, and I caught it in the touchdown. So I can say I caught a touchdown in Giant Stadium before. I mean, I used to work in the Buccaneers. Thank you, Evan. Thank you, Evan. Thank you, Evan. I said, unfortunately, they're not going to make the playoffs, so make sure you're not. I actually taught a class at Madison Square Garden. Oh, yeah, I saw you doing that shit with the next play, bro. Bro, you was on the thing. I was looking at the video like, why did I go to that shit? Well, you know, back to the point. So basically, what happened this year was, since we just started the...
boxing academy already yeah, since it's tie in. Exactly. Oh, so the banks still like you said. So whatever. That was what I was doing. What I got to do is. And if we do, we can actually collaborate a building together, you know what I'm saying? An all stop shop. Learn how to box, I mean, learn how to, like, you know, sure. lose weight, so whatever you want to call it. So, yeah, I mean, it's good. Yes, yes, yes. Right. We got, we got, we got, we got to, I mean, what, this is the one of the greatest things about walking through Rejects Worldwide Radio. When you're walking through here, you never know what the hell people do. Yeah. You see, hey, he's walking here. The first time I seen hey, he's walking here. Right, right, right. He's talking about average Joe, whatever. Then I hear his back. You got that shit in the trunk, right? I knew him for a good Yeah. Not just the hoes. No, I, I mean, I always yeah. don't realize for like all my life, so yeah. that's how come we became co-hosts. Choco's got bought. Disgusting. I always, I just always saw them like, 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 it's crazy how art, like, y'all music is not out, like, on our different. Yeah, it worked. Right. Like but you know, you, you see, you see little by little with the, with the, What's going on though? It's like Wu Tang. Wu Tang they all hot ninety seven right now getting played. You know what's like, the main thing? And they bringing that crack. It's and then right. when you sit there as an artist that you are now, because your head's so big, because you rich now. You, you but did. when you actually sit down, and you listen to other artists like Wu Tang yeah. and Nas and all these people. You have to sit down and. Even by yourself, because you don't do it in front of niggas, but you gotta reevaluate your fucking rhymes. Yeah, you sit there, you're like, yo, dog, I just said some simple shit, and they going off but, on one syllable. But you can like, tell, the like, whole verse, like, oh shit. And you like, can tell that hip hop's coming back with the crazy. crazy. It's just bad shit. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, here's a blockbuster right now. December 15th, like, oh, Revival comes out. Eminem's album's coming Look out. December 15th. Set that shit. Crazy. See what's coming out? Crazy. It's, it's crazy. Jonah Lucas. You see what's coming out? Crazy. It's crazy, man. Crazy, man. More lyrics, more lyrics, more lyrics. More lyrics is coming out, man. For your local artists. It's coming right back around, man. Cause you have to sit there. A person could like no Uzi. You can't tell, you can't say shit to that. It is that he's the man. But you sit there and be like, yo, let's go bar for bar. Shay, that's over. Money on the couch. Over. Over. Thank you. 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 If you would go verse for verse right now with Eminem and Drake, right? Check this out. This is Akon saying this. He picked Drake over Eminem, over Bart. Not, not the fact that he, no respect for Eminem and what he has done for the game and, and, you know, coming, especially being a white guy rapper and being accepted to the black community, you know what I'm saying? It's the fact that can Eminem keep up with, 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 the, with what's going on now, the style? We still hearing... Ron, Eminem will always go off bars and always sound like, you know, it, it, it'll always be bar. But Drake can go bar for bar and also transition into what's going on now. So if you want to expect the hottest verse, not not, come, not battling, but hottest verse out of Eminem and Drake, Akon saying that Drake would be. But you cannot, you would never hear, you cannot hear gun bars from fucking Drake. But you can hear gun bars from, from Eminem. Eminem. That's okay, crazy, man. Yeah, that's that. crazy, right? If I hear Drake yeah, do gun right. bars, I would flush that shit. Into but story. if you hear Eminem, you we'll believe it. Other shit. No, it's, it's, it's maybe, maybe. Look, I ain't, he I'm went through shit. Yeah, he did go through a lot. He crazy white boy. Who knows to carry a pistol yeah, here and there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You got to remember, nigga, he killed, he did a song for his daughter. That, killing his baby boss. God knows what the fuck he's doing. Crazy. Don't say, don't say, this is hip hop. It's hip hop. I think Drake is the friend of the past. I think Drake is going to be a legend, too. I think he's a legend already. Just like I think he's one of the best. I think he. I think he's on my top ten. He's on. He's definitely on my top ten. I, I as an actor, as a rapper, as an actor, as a rapper, yes. I say yeah, he's my top ten period because his wordplay is as long so as good. Look, if I'm an actor, have a song I can, that I can say as long as I'm an actor, look, as long as I'm an actor, I can pretend. I can be you, but I can't. You, I can but, be anybody. Uh, and if I can take that and take it, but that don't matter. I'll do it. I haven't heard a, a, a whack Drake song. I never heard a white Drake song. Yeah. Never. I haven't. He just spoke to me. He was saying that you didn't like it. It's probably a white Drake product. It was in whack. You just didn't like it. But I, no, I haven't heard nothing bad. I haven't heard no whack bars from Drake. Well, I, there's nothing that. There's nothing that. Had the there's nothing that Hot 97, Charlamagne, I mean, 105.1. Well, Charlamagne, they never said that. They never said they. 
like, like, talk like, bad about Drake. Like, so. um, I'm disappointed in Drake verse. Nobody can really say I'm disappointed in Drake verse. I'm Rick. disappointed on that. Drake yeah, is Captain yeah, Hook, too. Yeah, that's half, uh, I was I'm disappointed about that shit. I said, what the fuck are you I doing? I think he Captain Hook, Hook, too. Like, you know what oh, I'm saying? Oh, you copy nigga shit. That's what he did. Captain. Yeah, uh, yeah, but that's what. But that's reference tracks. You know what I'm saying? And he gave the credit on his oh, album. It says the, the name of the people that he gave credit to. But still, you still it's copy it. It's not, it's you know not original. But if, you, if, but if you do that, then you got to get Jay-Z for that. Because Jay-Z been slagging Jack the, 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 since the 90s. Hey. You know what I mean? Yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah I, that's, I, that's another I, opinion. Because like, 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 I'll see some ladies like, tonight that see me hanging with some Jay-Z. Yeah, that's Jay-Z. Biggie shit. That's Biggie shit. Like, bro, like, it's all reference reference. Yeah. It's all reference. Talking about Jay-Z, did you know that he said that he would... He admitted no, yeah. I'm, I'm just going a whole different way about this. He said that he sees someone like uh, Dave Chappelle being president. That somebody said Jay Z for president, and he actually worked for the government and shit. I forgot who his name was on TMZ. No, but he said Jay Z for president. The Rock is running in 2020. The Rock. The Rock is gonna win. He's a better win. The Rock is gonna be in Washington. Like, like finally, The like, Rock. And Dio, the Rock is cooking. Crazy. Just imagine him talking to Putin. He's like. That more. It doesn't matter who you are. Yeah, we can't have presidents doing that shit. Dude. Why not? Go to war for no Why not? Oh, you motherfuckers! Why not? We have, we <laughs> have, no, imagine we, he is he is North Korea, but that doesn't have matter. It doesn't matter. matter. We dropping bombs down. Boom! <laughs> oh shit! The rock, <laughs> motherfucker. It is not why it bitch? It is no. not gonna, you're not gonna. You're not gonna. Some moment. Yeah, whatever the fuck you are, you dark skinned motherfucker. He's born in America. We see some moment. Some moment. He's king of Samoa too. Listen. Not Hawaiian. It's different. So oh, it, it's an island off. It's an island miles away from, Ooh, from Hawaii. Well, he was born in Hawaii. I was he wrong. was born in Hawaii. Oh yes, he was. Was he? Yeah, he had to be born in Hawaii. No, Why? his father no, was. No, he was his born. father was. His yes, father was. was. I'm gonna Google that right his now. Google that shit. His father was, but I don't think he was. I, I think, think the Rock was born in the states. He was in California. Right? Florida. Oh, Florida. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, Miami, Florida. No, he went to Texas. Texas. I know he played for Miami. He was born in Hawaii. He was born in Hawaii. Miami or Texas? Which one? Because he got that Texas shit on his shoulder. But he was born in... Now he doesn't happen no more. We both covered our Brahma Bull. Oh, yeah, the Brahma Bull, too. The Rock was born in California. That's what I just said. And the Rock is from Samoa. Samoa. His whole family is Samoa. Rikishi, all these... All these, the Usos, Jimmy Snooker, all these people. Well, one of the guys, one of the the guys from the wrestling, he's Samoan too. The Roman Reigns, all of them, that's just a Samoan family. Don't call them Hawaiian. Right? Hawaiian. That, that, that's that's Hawaiian. Don't get offended, bro. Hawaii. They're not pineapple juice drinkers. That's why, <laughs> that's why he made the movie Moana. 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 Marijuana? Marijuana? I like that movie. <laughs> Marijuana? I like that movie. I saw that shit with my daughter. I saw that shit yesterday. I saw that shit like 16 times. But anyways, I think The Rock would be... No, I know. We got five more minutes left. Four more minutes. Five more minutes. We got seven minutes. We got seven minutes. We we (laughs) started. Definitely. No saying. We're back in two. No saying. Shout out to you guys. I'll let you guys. No, no, no. Kevin's still here. Still here. We're still still here. Stay Hayes. Where you going? (laughs) A little too graphic. Hey, I feel like um, Matt Lauer's uh, victims. Okay. So yeah, man. Um, I think we're here for the president. He already got the world. Like. I mean, you really got the world. You got millions and millions and millions of fans. I, I you the rock. I, I, I feel you, like he can probably pass it off. I'll tell you one person that will be here. Yeah. Well, two people that will be him. Either Michelle Obama or Joe Biden. Because you put Joe Biden as president. Where's the rock going to go at? Why are you shaking your head? They're best friends. Can I own take a He called this. I don't yeah. drink any like that. I don't like it. It's crazy. It's going to be interesting. It's going to Well, impeachment has to happen yeah, soon. To the people. Yeah. Impeachment has to happen soon. Um, oh, um, Petty just came to me with some news. I don't know who Aaron Bond is. Aaron Bond. But it seems that he's about to be the new manager of the New York Ever Boots. Yankees. Ever Boots? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get the fuck out of here. Hey, yo, Petty. What you think about that, man? I thought it was Petty. Like, um, who the fuck is that nigga? Um, 
Alex Rodriguez. I thought it was Alex Rodriguez. Yeah, J Lo cool sound. They said it was Alex Rodriguez the, 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 for, for, to land at the Yankees. Aaron Boone will be a manager. You sure? Of course. That's, too. that's breaking news right now. They were talking about A Rod just now. ESPN. That's fake. Oh, he's been. ESPN. 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 Right now, they just dropped it. Also, uh, Aaron Boone. The guy who went the 2001 um, to send the Yankees to the World Series against Sam Wakefield, Sam Wakefield is going to be the manager of the New York Yankees. So that's going to be interesting. Ladies and gentlemen, tomorrow. I don't agree with that. Tomorrow. But let's see how it goes. Let's listen, see. And listen, before, before, we, before we wrap it up, I always wrap it up. <laughs> anyway, no, before, we, before we wrap it up, right? Um, tomorrow, December 2nd, you have your event. What time? Yeah, uh, we're doing it from nine to one. Nine to one. Yes, sir. I'm not exactly nine sure nine what time the CKO camp, is like a boot camp nine. starts, but I think it's gonna be like three to four o'clock. Go three or four o'clock. Come down to the CKO. Come after out, that, yes, after that, make sure you're in a beautiful environment right. in that evening, because Miguel Cotto oh. Oh. is fighting, Fuck. and it's gonna be his retirement fight. Ding ding! I'm gonna be watching. For, I'm gonna be watching that shit on my phone from the art gallery. I remember all his Boom! No, no, the art gallery is in the morning. No, it's at night. Like that again. It's nine o'clock at night to one o'clock. Oh, nine o'clock at night. Yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna be, wa I'm gonna be watching the fight from there on my phone. Oh, that's gonna be. I might have a bitch. I watch, I watch the fight the next day. I don't care. I I'd rather I rather. I don't be caring for fighting no more if it ain't if it ain't Mayweather. I gotta get I gotta get my tattoo. Beating nigga ass. Huh? I should go play some network too, Sam, because it's gonna be a lot of people who just say we the best. Oh, so yeah, yeah, good. Don't forget to know. Also, don't forget to have somebody yeah. to work too. Yeah. 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 Go down yeah. to Jersey yeah. 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 Girls Mall tomorrow. There's a help expo. Um, me and him did a help expo in uh in in the in the MetLife Stadium. So tomorrow there's gonna be one in um Jersey Garden Mall. So if you guys are about your business, about your trade, about whatever. Everybody's gonna be out there. Go out there with your business cards. Go out there with your business cards. Promote your business. Promote Rejects Worldwide Radio. Promote whatever you do, and we're gonna continue promoting you guys. Listen, people, our show is the Friday Night Dancing show. It's the prepare. Friday Night Dancing for you. So Shout out to right guys. It, yeah, I'm a little saucy right now. It's the <laughs> Friday Night Dancing pregame show, right? And we said, and our and our main objective is to have fun on our show. We do a little bit of news and whatever. We do a little bit of news and whatever uh, to, to, to politics, whatever. But go on, have a good night. Enjoy yourselves. Listen, the tree is lit in New York. Go view the tree. Um, come down to... Be safe. We're going to be at 415, 417, Street, downtown North. Make sure you come. Yeah, you, we got a lot of dope ass artists. If you want to be a part of Reaches Worldwide Radio, first follow us on our Facebook, then follow each and every show. Download that. And follow uh, each. If you, if you still haven't downloaded, if you don't Instagram. follow sixty-five people that we follow, then there's nothing wrong with your ass. You're not going to be a part of the team. Every Jake's follow every show, every person in here, and. So Friday night that's a pretty good show. This shit is brought to you. Sponsored by Rejects for my radio. Lost and tribes. Sponsored. And and you might walk away. No small vibe. Yurt. Yeah. 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 Yeah.